everyone. Hope you're having a great day. Jen Loves Wrestling here. Um, we are coming up in less than about 45 minutes until uh, NXT starts. Uh, my day has been quite busy today, so I'm just going to try and put out a quick video for you guys. Uh, just covering a couple matches that happened this past week that I thought were particularly noteworthy. And I'd like to have a discussion with you guys about. So without further ado, let's start with SmackDown. Uh, we had our intergender match with Sasha Banks versus Reginald, and this was really cool in just so many ways. Number one, WWE doesn't really do intergender matches, and when they do, um, number one, it's been a very long time since they even have it all, but when they do, it's usually um, either in like some sort of comedic form or it's not really much of a match. It's not really showcasing uh, both people's separate talents specifically and kind of meshes them in the way that this match just really worked in this particular case. Um, I think they complemented each other really well. This was, in my opinion, just one of the matches of the week. It was, number one, the shock value with Reginald. We didn't know what he could do uh, coming into that match. So to have him in the ring with Sasha Banks, one of the best, not just female wrestlers, but one of the best wrestlers in the world. Uh, Reginald brought his own... His own uh, brand of just excitement and flavor and fun to this match. It was so enjoyable. Sasha picks up the win, but this match was really great. Uh, I'm curious to know what you guys thought of it. I really loved it. Another match that I thought really uh, deserves a spotlight this this uh, week was Sheamus versus Miz and Morrison. And let me tell you why. I think that the storytelling in this match was really top-notch. I think that Sheamus, number one, the selling, was awesome. It really, everything in this match, combined with it being a handicap match, them targeting his knee, just really built up sympathy for Sheamus. It really made him, um, it really just made the story work in that particular match. This is honestly some of Sheamus' best work that I've seen. I really like the direction that they're going with Sheamus, so, um, this handicap match, to me, I really thought that they did a good job with storytelling here. So, we got the Royal Rumble also coming up this week. Um, this weekend on Sunday. I'm really excited about that. Royal Rumble is probably my favorite WWE event of the year. Has been since I was a kid. It was the first WWE pay-per-view that I ever seen uh, back when I was growing up. So it always holds a special place in my heart. And it's always a really fun show because we get lots of surprises. And uh, since they've incorporated the Women's Royal Rumble as well, that's always really fun. And I'm really hoping that Bayley picks up the big win there. Um, I'd love to see her versus Sasha, WrestleMania. Um, the main eventing that show is a hill that I am willing to die on, but what WWE does, we will see. So, uh, let me know what you think about, uh, those particular two matches that I mentioned, the show coming up this weekend, uh, let me know what your thoughts are, what you're hoping to see, um, and enjoy NXT tonight. Alright guys, love you, don't forget to like, subscribe, share, all that stuff, have a good night, bye. Mwah.